right, we're doing page 72 chili crisp udon noodles with dumplings. These are a cult favorite for anyone who follows me on the Instagram. Everyone I think who buys this book cooks this recipe. So let's put it in a video so you are all across how to make it rain noodles in your house. Easiest dinner in the world and they are delicious. And it's all about the sauce. Super simple, one, two, three, four different sauces and you have yourself a saucy sauce to sauce your noodles. Let's say sauce one more time. Sauce. <laughs> okay, let's go to the, the noodles. So these are a prawn and pork with garlic chive dumpling. I love a prawn and pork dumpling. You get the good stuff from the pig and the good stuff from the prawn. They come together and they make these little baby dumplings. These guys, Ani Dai, thank you for making dumplings easy for us and delicious. Should we start cooking? Have I said enough things? <laughs> this is a cooking show. So we have this ugly stove, even though I have a beautiful stove back here. Cook these from frozen, don't thaw them, straight in, literally, boom. So these take six minutes to cook. We get going with the sauce. Two of these, black vinegar, just two of these. So I've kept the ratios all the same just so that your tired brain can be across it. Two of these. So two, two, two. And it's not gonna come out, because the lid's on. <laughs> I'm just gonna add my noodles to my dumplings. Obviously, because I'm adding frozen noodles, it's gonna bring the temp down, so I reckon we'll go for another four minutes now. Fifth Street Pantry, chili peanut. Mike Bones, local guy here in Christchurch. So just full of flavor, chili, onion, and that red oil just sends the noodles into happy land. So two teaspoons of that. You could do two tablespoons if you like it insanely hot. So you're not even gonna try and stir that because that hot water is gonna turn that into more of a sauce. So at this point, you can set that aside, get your shallots out, uh, I think in the book we call them spring onions. So just thinly slice these. This is called feed me fast recipe. <laughs> Slap it together. And then julienne your cucumber with one of these. Or just chop it. You don't have to even, you could even grate it. But this is fancy and fun. So boom. Whoa, look at that. That's like a fancy Wednesday, Wednesday night dinner. The freshness from the cuke cucumber on top of your hot noodles just sets it off and you could even have these cold like cold noodles um, we often do that in summer just have like a nice cold noodle some shredded chicken on top mm, so easy so that's some health and then happiness <laughs> that's pretty much ready we'll just check our nudes see how noodly they are they're looking pretty good dumplings looking good Cook Me is all about really approachable recipes and each recipe is done three ways. So we've got 30 dishes three ways and each way is its own level of how hard it's gonna be. So slap it together is like your easy, no fuss, get it on the table ASAP scenario. O2 is my ride or die recipe that is usually pretty simple, but it's just, a game changer recipe. And then the long game takes a little bit longer. Is it worth it? 100% it is. We loved that the book could then, you know, work with you, your life, how much time you've got, what you can give to a recipe. It's always gonna give back flavor. It's always gonna give back deliciousness. And this recipe especially is takes you 10 minutes. So why would you not? Um, peanut allergy, you could ditch the peanut butter altogether. Maybe it's a sesame oil and a bit of miso instead of peanut butter. Something that's gonna give it that silkiness. You just want something with a bit of fat on it um, that's gonna coat your noodles and give the sauce that emulsification that it needs. And that's a really big word, but. <laughs> Dumplings are ready, noodles are ready. We wanna keep some of this water. It's gonna make everything saucy. So again, the magic two, maybe even three. <laughs> just to kind of bring that to temperature, heat it up a bit. Meanwhile, we will strain these guys, pop them straight in your strainer. Same pot back on, some shallots in, not all of them, keep some prettiness. 
sauce in. So that like starchy noodly cooking liquid is also doing things to kind of saucy up our sauce. All right, we're already ready. So in the go. You could eat this straight from, <laughs> straight from the pot, but we won't, we will serve it like real humans. All right, we're ready to serve. So noodles in, dumpling in, chili to bring the beautiful red color out and spice things up a bit. Cucumber. Uh, I might just have it just off to the side. And that is the easiest dinner in the world. Boom. 10 minute dinner, page 72. Can't go wrong, udon chili noodles. Delicious. <laughs> I don't know how to finish a recipe.